right, we are at TSC again. And, wait. Um, we had to return one thing and we needed to get these uh, insulator, claw insulator things. Oh my gosh, listen. After what the vet told me today about Stella, um, Ruby needs there are no fatter. more treats. Yeah, Ruby does need to get fatter. I play for horses, for dogs. For dogs. Got it down. But we're not getting it, so now you can put it right back up. Little Miss Driver. Yay, I know. <laughs> I know. I'm 11. I know, well you're almost 12. Well. When you bend all the way backwards. <laughs> oh my God. Our... All right, where's dad? Let's go. I'm ready to go home and set up our farm. So, what I haven't been telling you guys is that late last week, I began to think that Stella's about to founder. I have been watching her move the last few days. We've been there and she's been really sore in her right back and opposite where she has um, the fusing hawk. And I've been worried about it and stressing about it. I don't know if you guys have picked that up in my videos, but it's been really scary for me knowing that she's at such risk because that's who she is. Stella is a high risk course for foundering. And um, I did send pictures on Friday to our farrier and he didn't think that by the picture she looked like um, her her hooves were you know too bad and uh, but he is coming on Friday uh, to you know to, to take care of her and I did call my vet on Friday as well just because I had the just I, I felt it you guys I felt so I called the vet and the vet was off and he came today and we're bringing Stella home. We're bringing Stella home right guys. now. Right now. Fiona's gonna cut the mats. Fiona's coming. She's she's amazing to us. Thank Mom, God. Mom. So uh, he confirmed that she is foundering and <laughs> that we need to start monitoring her food in a very severe way. Like it, this is it. Like we are going back to the way it was at our old barn. We are going to be soaking her feed and we are going to be. She needs to be in a very small pen right now. A small paddock. Um, we're, we're gonna take care of her. Oh, Stella is coming home. She's coming home today. We're working on getting Willow home this week as well. We don't want Stella to be a, be alone, which is horrible. Um, but, but we'll be with her 24 But we will be with her a lot until we can get um, Willow home. And I don't know, one day, like I, Sam and I are still working out the details, but Willow is coming home too. But anyway. Come look at our new job. That's the, just wait, that's the story about Stella, and even though it is horrible, I'm so stressed out. I'm excited too, because we're bringing our girl home. Okay, <clears throat> Stella's gonna be a devil with the trailer since she won't go on. Hopefully she'll go on easy peasy. Um, but we but, did get something new look, yesterday. Just but wait. look at our new job. So yesterday I told you in the video we got something new and this is it you guys. These are the jump cups and they have horses on them. Yeah. It's all they're all new. They've just been, never been used. They've just been a display at our greenhawk store. They um, are going out of oh, business. Look, we got and mini poles. We got mini poles nice. and green thinking. and white poles. Ruth is thinking. But well we'll fix that fix that but yeah these are our new jumps Shh, get a coat on it is cold in here but anyway uh, Fiona's coming we're gonna build her paddock today tomorrow I'm gonna get this finished yeah it's uh oh my gosh it's a flood oh dear lord no, don't run with your phone in your pocket. Great, that's fabulous. What? Well, don't walk on it. Basically, it's so much to do in such a little bit of time. Anyway, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna start working and, and bring Stella home and get stuff done. And I'm gonna show you, maybe by the end of this video, you're gonna see Stella here at our farm. Breathe, Laura. 
Whew, gosh, you guys, this is happening. This is really happening. the whole thing's over again. We had to switch. Uh, oh, did you? Yeah. Why? Didn't like my job? No. Nope. These have lines in them on the other side? Yeah. And you, it's easier just to score straight across the you line. You have to cut along the line, and line instead of cutting it. Oh, yeah. It's not how this should be YouTube. good, so. I watch you too. Yeah. Oh, well, that was a lot faster. Just keep them on top of the sawdusty ones. So the, She'll fluff them up herself, these ones. So they, they get compressed in here, and as she moves around this bag, it's gonna look like it's three times thicker than it is. Okay, so. By tomorrow. So, so small, thin stuff, green bag goes bottom. Yeah. I use both, because I find that it catches the pee better, like clumping kitty litter. Yeah. And then the top stuff is fluffier oh, to sleep in. Yeah, that's so, so I kind of use a mixture of it. It'll yeah. eventually just get mixed all together. Yeah, I've read but that. I just find it's better. I've read that people do that. Ruby. Girls and let her do her thing. Your mom closes first. There you go. Aww. Go, go Stella, ahead. I'm sorry, honey. I know. It's okay. She's like, is there food? That's gotta come out. There we go. You're so pretty. Look, she likes her window. <laughs> she likes her window. We gotta get her water. Look at the heat coming from her body. I I know. I need to go get the mini tonight. No, you're not. Yeah, we're gonna get you some water right now. But then we bribed her with hay. <laughs> you bribed our horse who's on a diet with hay. Yeah, she's she's stressed, so she's sweating. Turn her Okay, somebody's gotta get the water. Gabby, can you go get water? She looks so pretty here. So I know you're lonely, honey, and we're gonna fix that. Go slow. What a good pony. Don't roll. I did see her roll the other day. She's oh, pretty calm. You go ahead and let her off, Gabby. Scary. What? I'm scared. Why? Because there's ice. Oh, she doesn't run. That's why she took her for a walk around. Girl. She is a good girl. She's like, what is happening to my world? She's, she's interested she though. Good in that we did not pay for it too, which is good. Yes, yeah, so I, I got it free with a blanket that I paid for, so it's kind of like paying for it. Mm -hmm. well, so you guys didn't see, but Sophie, <laughs> Sophie fell in the water. Sophie face dived. She face dived and <laughs> did a swimming movement. <laughs> Just keep swimming. She's just, just like keep this. swimming. <laughs> Flat on her belly with her arms out to her side. Stella's like, ha ha ha. Put it on the bottom. Just regular. She's good. You got excited. 
here. So we can do this like a hundred times a day, yeah. except for she's not supposed to, to walk that much. No, but she can come in here and stand. Yeah. All right, so our nice pretty barn is pretty messy. Oh yeah, well how, oh we turned them off maybe. He's got lots of Okay, so we're back at the barn. We're just getting Stella's stuff right now. Um, we had to go to our other barn and pick up her grain and stuff. Pick up some of her grain. All she gets is Grow and Win, which is just vitamins. Our vet was adamant that she needs to be on it because she's going to be on a weight loss um, adventure again with us, like she was at our old barn. And um, she's going to be on stall rest a little. She's going to have a small paddock. A lot of you guys are freaking out on Instagram about Stella being alone. She is going to be alone hopefully for two days while we get the mini. And she's ill, you guys. She's really not well. She is not well. She needs to be on stall rest for a little while. She needs to have a very small paddock. She needs to move around and not at all. She needs to just stand still and rest. That's all that we can do for Stella right now. So um, the way our vet put it to us is that friend or no friend... She needs to, this is what she needs right now. So this is, what, this is what's happening. And I get it that you guys, um, you know, don't want her to be alone because we don't want her to be alone either. All right, so it is dark in here. You guys need to change her blanket too. Yeah, go ahead and close her window. Uh, we opened her window today so that she, because it was kind of, it was like plus 10 degrees today. So uh, go in there and close the window, Gabby. Yeah, so we opened it so she wouldn't be super hot. She was hot getting off the trailer. She's like, thank you, Mama, for my supper. You guys can hardly see her there. <laughs> can you get that, Gabby? Did you guys see earlier? She loved her window. Um, another thing is uh, we'll be here. We'll be here a lot. If we can't be here, somebody will be here with her as well, just so that she's not alone. Because we really care about her, you guys. And... We're gonna get this right. We're gonna fix this up and she's gonna be a totally different horse by Christmas. <laughs> by Christmas, this is gonna be a long journey because she's not going on a starvation diet, nothing like that. She's gonna just, she gets her pill in the morning. Nighttime hay. Yeah, is all her hay gone? Well, she needs her nighttime. Is all her hay gone? I don't know. She cannot have a licket in her stall. Uh, here is Stella's hay for tomorrow. We're taking it up to the house and we're going to soak it overnight on our porch. Bring it down in the morning. What, did, uh, what time do you have to get up tomorrow? Seven. Earlier to take care of your little eight, girl. Eight, eight, eight. No, eight, she has to be eight. fed by eight.